Hi, my name's Laura and I am going to teach you how to make veggie stock without having to fuss about. When you are chopping up veggies, you might be the kind of person that doesn't like using the broccoli stalk. What you can do is cut it up a little bit. Ends of onions are really good as well. Ends of garlic, anything, beetroot leaves, um, old herbs. And all you do is you have a plastic bag in the freezer. Simply grab the plastic bag you've already got full of other scraps you've collected over the last week or two. Then chuck the new ones in. Skin and all, don't worry about, don't get scared of skin, it's fine. There's a bit of bok choy in here, it's all frozen and gross, don't worry about that. This is going to be a beautiful stock. So, chuck it in the pot. You want to just cover it with water so it's covered, but not too much more. Okay, so this has been on the boil for about an hour and a half. I've, I've added water to it, um, periodically just a glass of water here and there. As well as vegetables, um, you can put other additions in there. I've got this ancient jar of bay leaves that I've got here that I've probably had probably for about five years. I've probably taken it to about three different houses. So you can chuck a few of those in. They give a really nice depth of flavour. Or you can steal fresh bay leaves off my neighbour's tree, which I also do, but I've run out of them. Um, you can also put in peppercorn. Some people don't like it. It gives a little bit of a peppery taste. If you're not into chilli kind of flavours, don't put it in. But you can put a few peppercorns in. And other things you can put in. I don't know. I think that's it.